and a new day is dawning. We just slept through the night once again. Let's have a look outside. Beautiful day. A bit foggy, perhaps. Is this the coming of autumn? Who knows? We could wash ourselves right now for a nice new day full of working because we do have a bit of work ahead of us. The first thing that we should be doing is checking on the trap that we have. And I also would like to get a few more skill points up. So as we can see, we do have skill points in every branch here. And the more we do of one thing, the more, um, well, experience points we get out of it. And in this case here, for example, I really want to get up the, with the survival knowledge to get us a fishing net, which is something that we have to go with. And what we can also see is that for all the other buildings that I have here, I do need some points like for the workshop i do need four more crafting points that is something easy to accomplish um survival is a bit more difficult to go with we also have the wood chat so i could have my locks in there then the firewood that i need and the resource storage but i think for now we should be good then with the crafting so crafting a few more things like a knife or like the axe that we have oh wait wait a second what's that a simple sack another container where i can you know put some things in this might be another thing that I want. So let's craft this one as well. Out of the ladder that we had. There's my trap. Unfortunately, nothing in here yet. So what I might want to do today is some hunting. Because now we are better at it, right? We do have quite a lot of spears available now. So I do have, I think, three, four spears is what we have right now. Because we also carry one. So in that regard, the hunting, we do need the experience points. So once again, let's have a look outside. Water is... Oh! Let's go towards the lake. Last time there was lots of game there and also something to drink if we need water. And it's not moving. Let's try it. And we killed our first deer. Very good. I think it was hit the second time and was wounded. So it wasn't able to move anymore. Very good at dough that we got there. So this should be quite a lot of fur and meat. Leather and meat that we have it. And hopefully also our hunting skills go up because of that. Oh, I'm getting good at this. Yeah, the head is never working. That's the second time, and the third time. It's still living! Oh my goodness, it's running around with my spears. The poor thing. I don't have a spear anymore, can I craft one? No. Ah, uh, what should I do? Where's my torch? Ah, uh, my axe. <laughs> I need to chop down this tree real quick here. The stack is waiting for me. I need to end its misery. It got two spears on its side. Right there we got the logs. There's the spear. Ah, look at that. It's running around with my two spears on its side now. I can watch that. And we have unlocked the workshop now with the crafting. Uh, poor thing. That was too high. Finally, out of its misery there. Poor thing. <laughs> and this leg was running around and spinning all over the place, yep. Yeah. Some leather and five meat. We got so much meat, I think this will quite bring us through the season. And we got also a new building that I want to cra or construct. Let's just see. We need to go back to the hut now. So that's what the chest is for. We can finally lay something in it. Or lie something in it. And can I sort this one? I don't think so. So at least I cannot sort it with weights. So we go with the sticks, obviously, that we can transfer. And let's just see how much want to transfer here let's say 25 sticks even though that is not very much what is really dropping me so so hard though right now because we don't have any logs 
meat. I've got 12 meat in store. It's in perfect condition. Oh yeah, meat is a bit ex bit weighty there. Let's get rid of 10 meat there for now. So that we can chop down some stuff. And then I can build the workshop. So that we have more trees. And I think I'm going to lose my stone axe now. To one of them. And there it is. Oh no, yeah. And I equipped the new one right away. Very good. Right, there we got a few locks. I can still carry something. Yep. Wait a second. My trap should be here somewhere too then. I don't want to have my... Oh, there it is. And look at that. There is another rabbit in it. Like, this is just producing dead rabbits here all the time. Um, I do have so much meat, but still, let's collect it. And the trap is now broken, so we do need to get us a new trap. And it just costs us some sticks. And I like this one because with that we do get some more skill points again for crafting as well. Which is very important. Right, and then we can just con continue with chopping down those maple trees. Alright, it's not falling. And there we have it. Once again, we're carrying too much. But I think for now it'll be fine. And where is the building storage? Nope, it was crafting right. Oh, we need we need one more log. Another hit. There it is. Then we got all the locks that we need. Right. -o. I'm a bit slow right now, but that's going to change once I place my building, crafting, and workshop. There it is. My second building. I wonder where I should put it. On the other side of the street, or right here behind the, behind my other house, like this. That should be possible. There it's possible. Right beside my hut. Or we place it on the other side of the street. And thus we have it. So when we switch now to the wooden hammer, we can see right away what is need or what still needs some building there. And actually, not that much. So it doesn't need that much to do. Actually, the wall is finished now. There are still some other walls. We need more locks for that. Oh, and I've lost the next wooden hammer. That was quick. More straws, right. So lots of gathering resources. The reed we have, fortunately, or the straws, right behind it. And it's not always one that we collect, but a few more of them. Very good. There we have it. Let's just see if that is enough. Right, here we are again, wooden hammer, and now we can finish it. That's the roof, that's the wall, wall number two, another roof, and the workshop is completed, thus we have it there too. What is pretty cool is, or odd as well, that the furniture is right in a building. So we've built the building now, and we do have the chest here right away that we can use for, and we also have, I think, the workbench, yeah. So on the workbench we can now, oh finally we can craft the bow. So for the bow we do need still the right technology, but this is where we would craft it. Uh, we also have the wood dough, some more wooden spears that I could craft here. It takes still the same amount of time though. Um, stone tools we have now. That's the stone skinning knife, throw, throwing rock. Alright, perhaps to have uh, something for traps or something like that. And... Yeah, that's pretty much it. So we should check our skills for for the... No, not, not for hunting, but for crafting. Alright, 214 we got here. 56 we got here. Before we can get a new skill point. And I will have to cook my meat there.
Okay, and once again, it is another day. What we want to do now is, well, actually go to the village because I do have received something here, the Unighost story. Um, I think I settled in nicely. Life is good around here. The soil is rich and fertile. Maybe it's time to go to Unighost and talk about my future here. Perhaps he seemed... Or perhaps he has some work for me. All right, there is a little spelling mistake. He has some work for me, so let's go there. Um, I have a pretty good feeling that it's probably about hunting or something like that because we were so successful at it, right? Right. Um, I'm really, I'm really excited though how we continue with this game because there are so many things that you can already do, and hopefully you are too. So let's get to the town there on this beautiful day that we have right now. I also love how far we can see into the distance. And here we are already in the village. As we can see, there are quests. So there is a quest, for example, I think in here. There might be something. Let's have a look. Namir. That is not Unigos, though. What do you have here? Do you have a minute? I just got back from working on the field. Tough job. Um... Oh, approval plus two. So this is about diplomacy. There's another skill tree about the diplomacy. So I guess you're used to being covered in mud then. Um, so that is really it, you know. So all of them have these different options here. Gisela, for example. Do you have a minute? Um, sorry. Oh, she's married. Okay. You here. Can you? Can I help you with something? She's got a quest. Do you happen to have any seeds with you? I'm making a little garden for myself and I could really use some. I'll let you know if I have any to spare. Right. So there we got a new quest. Little garden. And have you had any gossips lately? Oh yes, plenty. Want to talk a bit for some time? Alright, that's it already again with her options there. But I get a bit of approval rating. Now, with the approval rating, as we can see up here, we do have... There it is, diplomacy. And this one goes up if we do these right choices here. And can learn more skills. Bartering, for example. So I'm still looking for this unique ghost character. And also some traders. There are some traders, for example, here, I think. Sobimir. Yeah, he's trading. So we could trade now. Um, we only have 50 gold right now. We need gold to also purchase new um, blueprints for new buildings as well. So selling a few things might be a good idea. The simple sack, for example, I never used it at this point. The stone axe is already at 65 condition. It gives some nice money there. So let's also get rid of my stone axe. I can just craft a new one. I do have two torches. Let's get rid of one of them. Um, I think I do have, yeah, quite a lot of berries. Let's sell 20 berries for now. That's 20 gold. So I've got over 100 gold right now, which is pretty cool. Um, spear, I'm going to keep my spears. And the stone knife. Yeah, they're so easy to craft and quite worth it. And as we can see here, he's also got a few things like eggs, um, animal feed. But so far, we don't need any of that. All right, I'm great. Thank you. And we get approval plus 10 there. We also need to find a wife. So in that case, it will be very important to find someone that likes us then at, at some point. She approves of us quite a lot, but we don't have any affection with her yet. I don't think we have that. So wife, there it is. Wife is a necess necessary to ensure the survival of your dynasty. Thanks to her, you will have an heir who, after reaching the right age, will continue your history. All right, because we ourselves can die, of course, as well. Um, probably due to age or some sickness, and in that case, we will then need an heir, otherwise the game ends. Alright, where's this guy? Should be... Wait a second, I think we need to activate the Unigo's story there, and then we should be able to see it. Alright, so he should be right... Ah, there it is. Right in front of us. And there he is, Unigo's... What a name. Okay, good to see you settling in, my boy. How is life treating you lately? Not too bad. I have my own house. I don't starve and people start talking to me more and more. That's good. I heard you picked up hunting habit recently. I did. There's plenty of game in the woods. Is that a problem? No. On the contrary, we don't have any stupid laws around here that would reserve the game for the nobleman. And you could do me a favor and earn some goods. I'm listening. There's a fellow hunter of yours called Sambo living in the lodge of his own. He doesn't like me much and he's a loner, but during his last visit in the tavern he dropped some remarks about bandits and wolves that could become a problem. Find out what he knows and I will reward you. Alright, and then we got a quest, or a follow-up quest, about bandits it seems. 
And as we can see, where is it? Up here. Very good, so it's pretty close to our village anyway. We need to go all the way then up there. That's probably something we're doing the next day because it's already getting dark. Let's just see what else we can do here. I think there's still something else in this hut there where there's so many people. No, this is just the seed quest, I think. She's married, you made that clear to me. Oh yeah, okay, she doesn't give me any clues about anything, really. Right, we got a few skills, though. Oh, uh, well, experience points for the diplomacy. So we are close to the, or we are getting to the next point. But for now, I think it's time to head back. And we should probably also craft ourselves a new axe. There it is. Easy as that, we sold it. So this is how we could make some money in the beginning now, right? We could craft some axes, some tools, we can sell it. With the money, we can then go in for the blueprints. So we have the management, we have nothing to manage at the moment. But technology, as we can see, there we have the hunting uh, lodge, for example, which costs... Um, 100 oh, the bow costs 100 gold. With this, we could craft a bow and we can afford it already. Or we go with the fishing hut. Oh, I love that. The bow would be something, right? Um, I think it's the most valuable thing right now. Yeah. Buy the scheme. Not enough technology. Oh no. Okay, something is not working again. We still need to um, gather more technology points for that. So we uh, probably will have to do more hunting. And back at our village, just when it's nightfall, we need to drink something. Um, probably about the hunting. Perhaps this quest gives us more hunting skills then. So I'm eager to do these, these, or this quest there. We still um, need some rocks. I probably will do that tomorrow then on our way to the hunting cabin. Um, I love that we now have two buildings. So it's more and more looking like a little settlement here. Um, we can, of course, as we can see, have lots of space around it here. And we're just along the path here. So where other people then might th coming through. Um, let's just see. The bow that I wanted to go with. Yeah, there we have the technology. And we do need to craft more things to gather technology, right? So, for example, in a wooden spear, a wooden building hammer, um, the wooden hoe. I can craft a wooden hoe takes a bit of time and for now I'm not going to use it but it gives me gives me some um, skill points there and I can then just put it in my chest there it is right so it's in my chest now and I can always then use it and come back to it all right let's also have a look at my food there real quick I should still have some roasted meat there it is and yeah I'll probably have to oh not sleep but cook more meat so I'm going to eat a bit, I'm going to sleep, and on the next day we're going to wake up then, once again. Alright, and it's a beautiful new day. Chapter 3, good morning. Oh, what I can see is that we probably have survived this season now. It might be harvest, or it might be autumn now. I don't know, but I think something changed. We do have a bit more fog now, and... Obviously, what happened is that I got a new quest there as well. Also, dynasty reputation. Each subsequent inhabitant you wish to join the village will only join when your dynasty reputation is high enough. Reputation is earned by completing different quests, chapters, and challenges. It is a valuable pass down through the generations in your dynasty. Can you be increased by fail or can be increased by failing challenges or bad? Oh, it's decreased then, all right. Okay, this is our um, reputation then. And in that case, we do have a goal today. What we see, we are full actually. We have, we are fully nourished. And yeah, we have to find this solitary hunter up there. Um, before I go there, let's just check my trap real quick. Because I think there might be a rabbit in it. Yes, there is one once again. Very good. So we are probably not going to starve for quite some time. Even though I'm eager to see how winter turns out. And... There was something else about the technology, though, that I wanted to find out. But it seems like I cannot do this now. No. Okay, doesn't matter. We have some quests to do. This St. John's word that everywhere is, I think this is just healing me right away. It's a herb. But I cannot collect it, so it's always just healing me up. Alright, and if we find some game, I will probably hunt this one too then right away. Let's just see that I equip my stuff. So this is on number three and the stone axe is on number one. 
Okay, there we got the axe. How much space do I have? Yeah, I could probably chop down one tree. I love the different animations that are being used when it's chopping down the, the logs there themselves. And with that, we can make some spears. As we can see, a spear only weighs 1.5 kilogram, whereas a log weighs 10. Or oh, actually, that's four of them, so two. No, actually. Why is this? Is it always that case? Yeah, because I think 21 berries weigh one kilogram. I don't think that one berry weighs one kilogram, right? So in that case, um, it's probably like this. And what we'll need to do is get now to the hunter. And then we'll continue here. Stay tuned.